Now to sports report. Defending champions of the African Champions League, Waidad Football Club of Casablanca have progressed to the group stage of the competition after beating Rivers United Football Club of Port Harcourt six goals to nil. Sports correspondent Sopringe Jaja has a report. Standing by to lift that trophy. It was a highly anticipated reverse fixture after the Moroccan and African champions were narrowly beaten 2 1 at the Adoki Amesimaka Stadium in Port Harcourt. Reverse United needed to avoid a loss of more than 2 0 to stand a chance of dethroning the reigning African champions. There was mild drama in the build up to the game. Reverse United had raised alarm that Moroccan police refused to allow them train at the King Mohammed Stadium. The Nigerian champions were unable to train at the King Mohammed Stadium as authorities refused to grant them access. The reverse United uh, began training. Training. The floor lights all turned off. We scheduled to kick off training at 8:30 p.m. And uh, as you can see, just a few minutes after 8:30, the lights, the floor lights, all turned off. As I speak with you, the match commissioner is here present, and he has witnessed everything that has transpired. Even though we were scheduled in the technical meeting, talking about the pre-match meeting, to train here at 8:30. When they finally granted them access, the lights were turned off. Over 45,000 football fans strung out to support the reigning African champions. Ayub El Maud opened scoring for wider in the 33rd minute. Reverse United Ghanaian goalkeeper Motokwali was sent off for elbowing wider player. Yaya Jabril easily converted the penalty spot. Stanley Gumas team ended the first half 2 0 down. The Moroccan champions took the game beyond Reverse United when Jabril scored again and Hamoud had completed the routing and the massacre for the Moroccan champions. The Nigerian champions have now dropped to the CAF Confederations Cup with another Nigerian side, Plateau United, who lost on a way goal route to Esperance Sportive of Tunisia after the match ended 2 2 on aggregate. So Priye Jaja, RSTV Sports. That's sad stuff.